This is Lee Garrett and welcome to another weekly tip video. Today, I want to talk about Unclutter on Mac OS, which is an application that I use every single day and have done since way before it became part of a setup subscription. Now, Unclutter is a really smart utility that allows you to create notes, access clipboard snippets, and also drop files for accessing later, all without cluttering up your screen with Windows. So I guess it's not just a clever name. If you don't have a setup subscription, you can purchase Unclutter directly from the Mac App Store, and it costs $20. However, here, I'm gonna launch it directly from Setup itself. I'll just do a quick search for Unclutter here and click open. Now, the first time it runs, you'll be given a handy little walkthrough. And while it's not a complicated application by any means, it's always nice to see developers taking the time to help you familiarize yourself with the app. We'll just skip through these pages as hopefully this screencast should function just as well, I hope. I'll click Start Using Unclutter at the bottom and we're presented with our Unclutter window. Now, just for cleanliness, I'm gonna quickly close down all of these existing windows here. And what I wanna do at the outset is show you how to invoke Unclutter from your desktop. So here we have a blank desktop and it's nicely hidden the application. You can't see it anywhere. To make it appear, Bring the cursor to the top of the screen and then do a two finger swipe down gesture to show the unclutter window. Now as interfaces go, it's pretty simple. On the left hand pane, we have our clipboard snippets. In the center, we have our files and on the right hand side, we have our quick notes. Let's start with clipboard snippets. Now right now there's only one, which is some text that I copied from a text edit document prior to recording. I'll just hide the unclutter window by doing a two finger gesture back up to the top of the screen. If I open up a Safari window, navigate to Screencast Online, and then copy that URL, I can do that quickly with Command L to highlight the URL bar contents and then Command C to copy. When I now pull down the unclutter bar with my two finger gesture, that URL appears. If I want to show the list of clipboard snippets, I can tap this middle three bar icon here to show the list. I'll just quickly add another one to demonstrate one more time. Let's go for bbc.co.uk. I'll copy that in, pull down the window, and we have another snippet appearing. All good. We can favorite our top snippets by clicking the star icon. And this will allow us to access a list of frequently used clipboard content by tapping the star icon on the right. That's just a quick preview of one of this week's Apple-related tutorials from Screencasts Online. Screencasts Online is your premium source of Apple-related video tutorials. All of our members get access to brand new, up-to-date tutorials each week, as well as unlimited access to our entire video archive full of Mac and iOS-related tutorials. You can stream and download all of our videos on your Mac, iPad and iPhone and even your Apple TV using the members-only Screencasts Online Apple TV app. Membership also includes a complimentary subscription to the Digital Screencasts Online monthly magazine, published each month and packed with videos, articles, reviews, as well as hints and tips covering all aspects of the Mac, iPad, iPhone, and all of the other fantastic Apple products. So, if you're ready to start getting the most out of your Apple devices, Visit ScreencastsOnline.com today and become a Screencasts Online member.